Hey everybody, um, I know you guys know that I'm a criminal defense lawyer and I wanted to talk to you about a situation that we run into pretty frequently. So we got this client, he got a speeding ticket and for some reason he mails the check in to pay a speeding ticket. But the check never arrives at the court and the court issues a warrant for his arrest. Well, he's now got a warrant out for his arrest and what is to be done in this situation? And I wanted to tell you about three things that, that can be really beneficial. So first and foremost, you talk to a lawyer, lawyer can reach out to the prosecutor, prosecutor can have that warrant set aside so that you never see the inside of a jail. And that's the most important thing is you know, reaching out, communicating with them, getting that warrant set aside so that you, know, you don't get booked in and spend the night in jail and, and go through all that, that hassle. Now, if it's something a little bit more serious, and occasionally we have this too, where you know a, a complaint has a typo in the address so it doesn't get served, or there's a more serious investigation and a, and a warrant's been issued on an indictment, there are things that we can do, that a, that a lawyer can do, to help you with that situation as well. And, and I think there's two huge benefits there. First is, um, you know, when you turn yourself in, uh, that sets you up for a much better bond hearing on the back end. So it makes for really good arguments at the bond hearing and with a lawyer involved, it gets you into court for that bond hearing that much faster. Second, when you turn yourself in with a lawyer, there's no legitimate argument that the police can make that they didn't know you were represented. So if they try to interrogate you, um, that's gonna be a really facially invalid interrogation. Um, you know, th that sort of questioning is, is illegal and they're not gonna be able to get away with that. So um, you know, there's a lot of situations that can end up with somebody having a warrant out for their arrest. And you know, I just wanted to tell everybody the value in reaching out talking to a lawyer about that. There are a lot of situations where a lawyer can just get involved to clean up that warrant situation alone. Um, if you think this information was valuable, I hope you share it. If you have any questions about this or any other topic about criminal defense, let me know down below.